feel like it is probably time for us to see if I can defeat fifth graders. To spice things up, literally in this case, I have my cup full of hot sauce. What I am planning on doing is we are going to give Mello a second chance. I don't want to drink the entire thing of hot sauce. If I'm unable to answer your questions and win this, I have to take a massive sip of it. This is a big cup of hot sauce, so I can take a lot of different sips. We're gonna give me a chance. I almost definitely am going to end up having to drink some. If I fail, I fail all of VTubing. I not only fail the class, but I fail all of VTubing, and I fail all of you. And by golly, I am not going to let myself be a fail girl today, so um... Woo! Communications with the Wii Remote have been interrupted. God, this scares Welcome me. Welcome to Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Thank Grader? Thank you! The game where you can win up to one million dollars. I want to win a million dollars! I'm gonna be the happiest anime girl ever. Let's meet your class. Oh, god damn, I remember Paul f***ed me over last time. Alright, Jed, you got an orange shirt. You got some style. Yeah. F*** you, Paul. Yeah, look at me go! Oh, I am styling! Look at my f***ing and titties damn they are popping out of my shirt which, which little snot nosed brat are we gonna pick to help us out not paul paul sucks he's wearing yellow yellow is a disgusting color i don't trust anybody who wears the color yellow dude jed is flashing his muscles and we're going with jed i'm answering my own question i'm going to go with jed all right i got my kid straight from the adoption center come home man we're a team now do not fail me or i'm sending you back oh god i'm sending him back anyway god that face game. is tragic. No wonder animal he got left science. behind. Okay, we're gonna do first grade animal science because I hope that it's going to be mellow. What sound does a cow make? And I can just be like, Moo, and then they will accept me. What is another name for the term domesticated? Me. <laughs> I'm assuming it is tamed. It is not feral because they bite and I do not bite. It's not wild, which I am, but it is not that. It's not migratory because I would only leave my home to go get food to go say hi to you so tamed we are going to tame our bitch today slam down that button it's tamed okay, i'm smarter than a first grader guys one thousand dollars right. relies on it all right blink blink if you need help <laughs> god blink if you don't need help i need her to actually just stop staring we're we're gonna be ballsy here i'm gonna do fourth grade reading i can read i just read that sentence man which of the following is a character in a book by dr seuss oh no sam it's because sam i am you are right Woo! sam baby we took it home together this is great oh he's from green eggs and ham i would have gotten the book wrong all right i saw justin we'll go with justin i'm going to go with Justin. I'm gonna knock it down. I'm gonna do this one first. Vocabulary? Not my f***ing thing. I probably have the vocabulary of like a, uh, probably a, a 10 year old with a lot more swear words. So I'm a little bit concerned. Wait, which of the f***? What the f*** is a homophone? I, oh my f***ing, I have legitimately no idea what this is. I knew that vocabulary was gonna me i legitimately don't know we're, we're gonna cheat i'm i'm sorry i don't want to cheat but i think we're gonna cheat mm -hmm. i'm gonna peek over at my kid's answer i trust my kid let's go justin he is saying slew and do i'm gonna do slew and do then i'm trusting you okay come on five thousand dollars kid imagine how many legos i can buy you no you absolute you me out of five thousand dollars you're supposed to be in fifth grade and you fail in third grade vocabulary? What a little bitch. This is why you should never have killed, like, children. Just fucking fail you. Look it, I even stuttered. I know. I even stuttered over my word and started to say children, man. That's how fucking heated I am. That is some bullshit right there. Maybe, if anything, we'll take him on a scientific field trip so that way we can go show him bullshit. And that way I can point at the giant turn and be like, look right there little buddy you see how nasty and stank that is that is exactly how i feel about you go Piece of yourself i hate children i have to take a sip of shit now look at him he's so proud of himself he's probably just sitting there like hey, five thousand dollars to take my wife out on a yacht ride and i'm just gonna be sitting here like five thousand dollars would have gotten me out of poverty where i could eat something more than rice and beans for the rest of my existence i hope you and your mustache are happy with yourself you better watch out because somebody might just come over and shave it one day i'm so upset all right it is time to say those eight magic words i am not, not smarter, smarter than, than a fifth, fifth grader. grader zero dollars zero dollars i got a great f i literally failed because of the child i am so mad i have to now
now take a sip of hot sauce, which you know what? Cheers, boys. We drink to that. Mm. Mm. Oh, God, that burns. Oh, fuck. All right, we're gonna do second grade math. We're gonna just get ourselves up the ladder slowly but surely. I can do this. How many cookies? What number is exactly halfway between one and seven? Uh, the fucking shit is a number line. What? I have never heard about this in my entire fucking life. I feel like it has to be four because if you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and if you have zero in there, it has to be four. That would be exactly in the middle. I have never heard about a number line in my entire fucking life. I am terrified. <laughs> God, I'm gonna say four. Four is going to take me home to victory. I will ara ara four times to bring this home for me. I'm about to fail second grade math, guys. I, I hate myself. I'm gonna scream. Like the right Yes! Yes! Oh my god, yes! Oh, my instincts! They're on point! I was legitimately so nervous. I passed second grade math! I can't believe it, but we did it. I wanted to pick Kara. She was good. You know what, Jed? You were very unfortunate looking, but you got me through life last time. I I'm taking you back home. That way, at the very least, whenever somebody looks at me and him, they'll be like, damn, she's at least, like, more attractive than that one. I want to zoom in on his face. Yeah! God! All right, we're gonna do third grade measurements. I have no idea why they would be teaching people this inside of third grade, but we're gonna just learn. I know inches. True or false, the abbreviation YD is put in the metric system of measuring distance. Isn't that yard? I think that that's true. I'm gonna go true. I'm going with my gut. I'm pretty sure that that is a yard. That is the American dream, being able to afford a house with a yard, and uh, I hope to get there at one point. Throw, baby! I feel confident about this one. Give me the five grand right now. I want it. This one's gonna feel good. Yeah! Oh, wait, no, it's right. That belongs in the second group. What? I can't What? What the f is the abbreviation for yard? Is it just why without the D? Why would you leave the D behind? The D is the most important f***ing piece of the f***ing puzzle. You f***ing bitch. You absolute f***ing bitch. I hate myself. Thank you. At least I got $5,000 so that way I can wipe away my tears with fancier paper on that one. Wait, 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 wait. Why am I still going? Oh, I didn't think I was still going. Oh, hell yeah. Dude, we're still going. All right. We're gonna give, uh, I wanted Kara. Why the f***? Can I pick Kara? She she has a butterfly. Clearly, she's gonna be flying high one day, and I want to pick her. But I guess I'll just pick Melissa pick instead. Melissa. <laughs> yes. Oh, she even gave me a little high five. Okay, I like her. We got matching pink shirts. Nothing's gonna tear us down. We got woman energy together. You know what? Fifth grade U.S. geography. I'm feeling cocky now. My cock is up at least two notches, and we are going to see if we can get this right. This is one of the biggest questions on the board. Oh, baby. Regardless what happens the rest of the game, the least you can win is $25,000. <laughs> what does a topographic map of the United States mean? I, I want to say it's elevation. That's what my dick is doing right now. It's getting elevated. I don't even have a dick, but my imaginary dick is f***ing alligator. Yeah, pff, elevated. <laughs> elevated. I'm going to... I'm putting my money down in elevation. That sounds right. Uh, I need to start, you know those that New Zealand thing? It's called, I think, the Haka, where they just start, uh, like, getting themselves going and they're super powerful. Yes! That's what I need to do! Woo! Dude, we are smoking at this round. I had to sacrifice my child, but apart from that, we're doing great. It's the grammar. We're gonna do science. I wanna see if I can pull some Bill Nye knowledge. What type of clouds have a white puffy appearance? Your classmate is now locked I, I don't know. I want to say cumulus because they're, they're accumulating all of the stuff. And if you start accumulating enough clear things, they're going to start turning white. Isn't that correct? Because that's what spermy wormies do. You have enough of the spermy wormies inside of clear fluid that makes it look white. I am going to do this. And if sperm fails me, my entire everything is just f***ing dead. It has the word cum in it. We're doing that. Cum. cum cumulus, please. I'm locking in. I like what I see, and I'm doing it. Please be nice hey, to me. Yes. Yes. I'm leg locking it. Yeah. 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 Gimme. <laughs> gimme, gimme. A few short hours of deliberation. Uh huh. You got the right answer. Yes! Okay. Hope never lets you down. When in doubt, the answer is Way always 
can see, and that is what that one does. What the f am I telling you guys? God, I'm getting off. I'm getting too high on myself. This is bad. I'm gonna do fifth grade world history. God, I hope I know this. History is something that I'm usually okay at. At the end of his transatlantic flight, where did Charles Lindbergh land? Oh my fucking god. Wait, transatlantic. He went from New York to... <laughs> he went from New York to either Paris or London, but I cannot remember which. I oh, God. Oh, I don't remember which one it was. I am going to put my money on the Brits. And I think that this is a very poor decision on my end, but I'm going to put my money on the Brits. Come on, London. Be nice to me. Don't give me the L. We want to just piss all over Paris. It smells like that anyway. Uh-huh. Give me 100000 I can pay my mortgage. I'm sorry. British because I knew that Lindbergh, he spoke English. I did not think that he would want to visit Paris because who the f wants to visit Paris to be completely honest and I lost my faith. Maybe this is back when Paris was f***ing cool, man. Well, it's time to drink I'm some more hot sauce. Flunked out of school. Yeah. I can't believe it. Believe it, girl. Before this is your you go, second time that you flunked. Two. We'll see you next time on Are You Better Than a Fifth Grader. Bye-bye, everybody. I don't want to see you anymore. I want to win please let me win i gotta see at least that's better than <coughs> that's better than some of the other ones all right we're playing again i'm not accepting a c i need to get ass i need it inside of this i need the a for this shit all right we're gonna skip all the all right, kids oh god i didn't okay. mean to click that well, one question is social studies who how am I supposed to know this? Dude, I can't even list the last, like, seven presidents. Let know the f***ing 16th. It was not Abraham Lincoln, I don't think. I don't think it was Andrew Johnson either. Was it Grant? I don't know if it was Grant. Okay, we're gonna start to think about this inside of, like, actual candidacy. So we had George Washington, and he was the first one. And then we had question mark, because what good does it have me know about this information? And then Lincoln was in 1864. Five-ish, and I think Grant was also around 18. No, Grant. No, what? Grant was around 1865-ish. Who the f is Buckingham? Is that even a human being? How the f is this first grade? I did not learn all the presidents when I was in first grade. I don't think I ever learned all the presidents. The school system failed me, man. All right, we're cheating. I can't do this. Pink shirt army. Give me the correct answer, bitch. Do we trust her? Is Abraham Lincoln correct? He was a pretty cool dude. I just don't remember if he's the 16th president or not. I'm gonna put my hope inside of the, the youth of America, and I really hope that they do not just f*** me over again. All right, Lincoln. Yep. You got a top hat? Clearly you have some money. I hope you take me to victory. Yeah! I need to win this game. I'm not stopping until I f***ing, like, take home a trophy that says I am smarter than fifth graders. So that way, whenever somebody calls me dumb, I'll be like, yes, but also, I'm not dumber than a 12-year-old. All right, hell yeah, we're gonna do fifth grade reading. I can read. We're gonna get rid of the hard ones early, and then that way, I only have a softy to deal with after. C.S. Lewis's book, Chronicles are Narnia, are considered to be what kind of fiction? Oh, God. I don't know. Are they tragic? I thought they were pretty good. I would not call it tragic. It's definitely not a comedy. I don't think it's biographical. Maybe allegorical? I feel like it would have to be allegorical. It's allegorical. It's an A. That's what I'm gonna get. You short hours of deliberation, mm -hmm. you got the right answer. Yeah! Excellent. I wonder what's an allegory of. Dude, we're gonna get learned up. The Chronicles of Narnia, Christian... <laughs> We're gonna do fourth grade U.S. history. We're gonna start from the top and work our way down here. Sometimes you gotta start at the absolute, like, tip top of the dick and you gotta work yourself down to the base and then your man's gonna be very impressed. That's what I'm doing today. All right, Jed, you are my little lucky star, Jed. You're coming back here with me. The way that energy moves through an ecosystem is called what? Uh, I thought that it was just transfer. You transfer energy through it, but if it's in an ecosystem, it... No. Oh, no. Oh, God. I'm gonna just be thinking out loud here for a minute. The food chain is when animal... It's like when an animal eats a plant and then another animal eats that animal, that is energy moving through the food chain. Or that is, like, 
Oh god. That is energy movement, but I don't know if that's the technical view of I feel like it's food chain. I think it has to be. I'm gonna pick food chain now. I hope that this is good. All right, food chain it is. If it's wrong, please you be nice. $25, really? <laughs> Thinking finally worked? Did you even read the question? Man, that was fast. Was that, dude, I sat there talking out loud for like five minutes. I think that we have different versions on what's fast or not. Third grade measurements. Okay. I failed no this last time with the YD. I'm gonna prove that I am smarter than a third grader this time. <gasps> amount of money that you have right now how many days does february have in a leap year there are four leap years to one actual year if i am pretty sure that already. that is correct it is going to be a 28 me thinkies unless it's not i think it's 28 it's 28 please I'm be correct god if i ended answer. up getting this wrong i was just gonna be like bitch 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 <laughs> nope sorry mm. wow i was sure about that one too I don't want to talk about this. These fifth graders must have studied even if you didn't because that is the right answer. He saves my ass. This is why this kid is the best. All right, I'm going to explain myself on this one real quick. We're going to do some real f***ing PR damage control. When I think leap year, I think of the, d the year that you are skipping. So you skip four f***ing in like february's where you have the extra day and then you add another one why would you end up calling it a fucking leap year if you're not leaping over it isn't 28 just like the normal months inside of february or am i actually fucking stupid jed saved my life i am saved by children that one's gonna hurt me for a little bit near what continent would you i know this one it's australia Australia. The Great Barrier Reef is right outside okay, Australia. Yes. Answer. I am redeeming myself. If it is not, I will cut the stream here. Thank you. I do not have to cut the stream here. Oh, redeem special. myself. Australia's most famous physical feature is the Great Barrier Reef, and it's not even on the continent. It's outside of it. That speaks a lot about Australians. However, Australians' actually most famous physical feature is the fact that all of their people who live there are hot. I have never seen an ugly Australian. If you are Australian, just like literally your continent is made of scary, scary things, but you have such hot people that people still want to come visit it. That is super impressive, man. Oh, Kara, let's yes. go, Kara. Finally, the secret weapon. She's coming. Kara, I've been trying to pick you for the last, we like, four games because I got good vibes from you, girl. I think that we're going to be able to accomplish this together. A pizza is cut into quarters. How many pieces are there? There are four because if you cut it into quarters, a quarter is one four, and it would be four. And if it is not four, I am going to shriek so loud, I am going to cause the power grid to just completely collapse it better be for that that is on my hands so therefore i can count it yeah we're gonna win we're gonna take home the million dollar it is question. come on how this deal oh man i'm so ready i'm gonna tell you the subject of the million dollar question okay and right then and there you'll have to decide if you want to try to answer it or not okay let's i will see what the subject of the million dollar question is Ooh, let's see i'm ready and there it is the million dollar subject now, is it sex ed is that what physical science is oh my god do i got that in the bag i might be a virgin but i can tell you flat out right now your girl has read so many dojins i got this shit i am going for it i am going big or i am going the calm exo oh what i have to type this in heat i'm gonna type in the word heat i oh god my boobs would get hot if you started touching them so i'm just gonna roll with that Heat also rhymes with eat, and okay, that's what I would do if you let me answer. win this. <laughs> Imagine the amount of nuggies that I could buy. Come on, man. Come on, bro. Locked in for the I'm locked in. Time. Give me the million. One it's heat. If they say it's thermal, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna be so upset. Please. It's heat. <laughs> I need it. Oh, she's she's ready. Look at her. She's rubbing her hands together. That's the prey motion. Come on, girl. We got this. I did it! It 
took heat. It took heat. I know this. I am a bitch. I know what it's like to be in the ovulation cycle. I can feel it. That is the answer, baby. Oh my god. I cannot believe that we f***ing won that shit. I think that I just crapped all over my legacy and giving out like four different names for Edison. One million dollars. I got an A minus. <laughs> One million f***ing digital buckaroonies for me to simply have bragging rights over anybody else who plays this game. Holy shit. Oh, we are going to play again. I need to just like confirm it. You remember me saying that we have to confirm that I'm shit three times? We have to make it. All right, fifth grade art. I'm an art kid. Art rhymes with fart and I'm gonna blow you guys away with my f***ing answer. Jackson Pollock, Barrett Newman, and Pierre Mondrian are examples of what kinds of artists? They are abstract artists. And if they are not abstract artists, you can go f*** yourself. Come from, they call that a right hand. Oh, where you're from, from A. Do you just decide if you're from another area that that is no longer the right answer? I'm going to say that the judge has bias and I'm going to withhold that statement actually until I need it whenever he is contradicting me. But I think this is good. What do we call the early period of the age of the dinosaurs? It was not the Permian. It's either Jurassic, Cretaceous, or Triassic. I think that Triassic was the last one. Jurassic was the middle and Cretaceous was the first. I might be mixing these up. You would think with how much of a dinosaur fan I am, I would know time periods, but your girl is not good with numbers. Numbers are not kind to me. I don't get numbers. I did have an old man once say that he would like me inside of his pocketbook if he was younger because he liked the way I looked. I have held on to that compliment for years now and it makes me so happy but actual numbers and orders of things my brain is not good with i'll remember the things but not anything else all right we're gonna go with cretaceous i feel like that's not correct but i'm it's it's too late for me i'm gonna be i feel like i'm gonna lose my position as a dinosaur lover at this point but that's okay wrong answer Triassic is first. Oh, no. Then why is it tree? Because that's the f***ing Triforce. That's the third inside of the f***ing Trifecta. That's wrong. People need to learn how to name things better. This isn't a me problem anymore. This is a society problem. Why would you have tri inside of the name when the three big periods of dinosaur history are Cretaceous, Jurassic, and Triassic? If you heard those out of context, which one would you think would be number three? Would you pick f***ing Cretaceous? No, you would pick Triassic, Tri being three. <sighs> We're gonna pick music. I'm really bad at music because my music taste is absolute f***ing shit, but I, I believe in us. True or false, lento is the musical term referring to the gradual increase. <laughs> what the f***? Is there a music bro? Don't actually tell me the answer. Is there a music bro or sis out there who actually knows what this is? A f***ing lento? That can't be right. That has to be a f***ing meme i cannot imagine somebody being like it's time to lento your tempos mother you do oh you guys are saying i do to me shucks that's so cute i'm gonna say false and probably eat my words you got the right answer I, ooh, oh i knew that was too stupid i knew it uh-oh right it is not Mount Olympus. I don't think it's Circus Maximus because I don't think that there's ever been a circus that has been there that long. Um, I am probably going to get this wrong, which is really embarrassing considering me Greeky and me ancient Greek god who, you know, was there when the shit was built and really should know. But, you know, your brain starts deteriorating after about 3,000 years, so you gotta cut me a little bit of slack. Just a smidge. You're Greek, not Roman? I know, but, like, Mount Olympus is Greek. I feel like they've thrown in some Greek shit just to get me all hot and bothered. Remember my people. I'm gonna pick the Acropolis. I feel like that has to be it because I think that there's the Greek Parthenon. Acropolis, I don't remember. If it's the circus, I'm just gonna end everything. I do not think that they would have a circus. Acropolis it is. Okay, I'm locking in my Just answer. ask the Roman gods. I really should just be like, yoo-hoo, right, yes, Roman gods. You're going for $50,000. I am. $1. Me, right here. Give it, please. That's not the right answer. Really? Oh! What was it? Was it actually the oh. f***ing... The How does that still exist? Gave. Dude, Tell the circus the doesn't even stay in my town for longer than, like, 10 days. How the f*** does that survive over 5,000 f***ing 
fucking years. I feel like that was a cock tease. That was a dick move. That was a certified clown moment. And I know that it is because they came from the fucking circus to say it. I think I failed. The end of the line, my friend. Yep. You just flunked out of school. You know what? Flunking out for $25,000 though is really not right, the end of things. Eight magic words. Uh, I, am I am not, not smarter, smarter than a fifth, fifth grader. grader. I am not smarter than a fifth grader i am smarter yeah, than a fourth we'll grader though i'm time. also smarter than your mom that's when you know it's really going downhill when you have to start making yo mama jokes all right, all right. we're out. back we're Are back i'm taking another swig of hot Make sauce and we're going for it mm. Mm. oh oh that one mm. that oh f that at the back of my throat um, I don't know why, for whatever reason, that sip was way worse than all the others. Where are the smallest bones in the body located? Not in me, since I know that all of you are hung. Ooh, well. All right, it would not be the ear, because the ear is cartilage. It would not be the nose, because the nose is cartilage. Ah, oh, fuck. I feel like it would have to be the foot, because those, uh, those little, like, pinky toes, those are very small. I feel like those have to be smaller than your finger. It could be the hands though, but I, I'm feeling the foot. Foot fetish, come home. If it is not the foot, then foot fetish people have failed me as well. It's it's the foot. Go. Please, it, it must be the f***ing foot. It cannot be the hands. No, no, it has the... That's no! Not no! Answer. no! How? Oh, no. I gave my soul to the foot fetishes and they said... You, you don't like us enough. God fucking fucking damn it, fuck. Yes, sir. You what? Saved by a fifth grader. All right. Nani the actual fuck. How are they in your ear? I've never heard of that. The inner That's the inner ear. That's inside of your fucking skull. That's not the outside part of the ear. When I think ear, I think the elephant ear. That's like outside of the fucking body. It's not the insides there. Oh god damn it. How many moons does Jupiter even have? The only important moon is that we have our moon up in the sky, and when you have somebody pull their pants down and bend over, that is also called a moon. That's the only part that you know. This should this is not a le this is not legal. No fucking fourth grader is gonna know this shit. I don't even think Galileo knows this shit. In fact, I know he doesn't because he's dead. He doesn't know anything anymore. I'm gonna say eight. Eight's my favorite number. Eight is going to have eight, and we're gonna do good, good things. Come on, bro. That was the wrong answer. Oh. You're kidding. Oh no. I wish he was kidding. The only joke the here is my life. Galileo. You needed to get good, brother. I know that this was probably a very, very difficult and challenging thing for you to do back when you lived, but imagine what you could have done if you doubled the amount of moons that you found and you found eight, so that way I could answer this question properly. Galileo, I don't know where your ghost is. I don't know if you're up in heaven or heckle. I don't know if the aliens kidnapped you to help, uh, you know, keep their Dyson spheres uh, a flowing. But that one hurt me. I think that astronomers need to get good because clearly they're slacking. I believed in them and they failed me. That sucks. I even got zero f***ing dollars. God. We have to win one more. I cannot be this big of a f***ing loser, man. I have to win one more. Oh God, I even accidentally clicked on Paul. It's all going downhill from here. Paul sucks. All right, we're doing first grade f***ing art. They only know how to use their and fingers really? to paint with, Earth you know, non-toxic shit because they all eat it and they're all stupid. We got all this. Right, First grade art. What do we call a color being white by adding the color white? I have no idea. <laughs> I have legitimately no idea. Dude, I'm even an art kid. We just call it like lightening it. I don't know. It's tinted. I'm gonna say tinted. Come on, man. It, it can't be tones. That's what happens to your muscles. Those are tones. It's got to be tinted. If it's texturized, like I'm, I'm quitting right now. This is, this is over. This it's Jover. One thousand dollars. Well, oh, thank you. All right, Jed, my ugly little man. It's you and me, man. Also, how the f are they up there? I feel like they can just watch the kids work. 
I wish I had that. That'd be the prime spot for cheating. All right, we're gonna do music because that was bad last time and I wanna get this over with. First grade music, second grade music, I can read. The song Frere Jacques, wait, what? In the song Frere Jacques, what is being asked of the brother? I feel like it's, are you sleeping? This is like an actual me deep diving into my thoughts and trying to remember something from childhood. I just am trying to remember it. Are you sleeping? Oh, wait, is it are you sleeping? Are you sleeping, Brother John? Brother John? Because that's one of them. I'm going to pick are you sleeping. That's for sure a song that is there. So we're going to go are you sleeping. That's the one that you have when you're a kid. And then when you're an adult, you have to go are you sleeping with my wife. And that is the way worse edition. Got the answer right. Yeah! Excellent. Are you sleeping? Are you sleeping, Brother John? Brother John? Ba ba da ba 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 da ba 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 ba. I remember nothing else except for the "Are you sleeping?" part. But you know what? That's all I needed. What former U.S. president is featured on the five-dollar bill? God damn it! We have one and we have five. Wait, is Lincoln not? F oh my god! I can't remember money. Give me a second. I'm gonna try and really like pull out all of my brain power for this. George Washington is number one. He's on the $1 bill. He is very frequently greeted by strippers, which is cool. And uh, he was our first president, so we know that shit. Abraham Lincoln, I think, is on the fiver. I'm pretty sure that that's our boy. And then I think that Jackson is on the 20, and Franklin is on the 100, and I don't remember who's on the 50, and I don't remember who's on the 10. I think it's five. We're going with my boy Lincoln. He abolished slavery and he has my heart, Walking so I in. think we got this. You would think with something that you tend to look at pretty frequently, well, you would yeah, actually, yeah. you know, like remember this shit, but I have not touched cash in so long I that I genuinely don't know work. this. You got the right answer. Oh. Thank you, Lincoln. I knew you were a cool dude. When in doubt, go Lincoln. He knows what's happening. This has been a really stressful thing so far. Who's on the $3 bill? Yo mama. <laughs> or me. Dude, I want to be on the $3 bill. Whatever I could actually do it. You're down to your last classmate. Oh, baby. Oh, Justin abandoned me. Did you see that? He literally just started to run over and now he- Oh, there he is! Welcome, Justin. Pick Justin. Which group of elements reliably forms acids when combined with hydrogen? No f***ing idea. Okay, I'm gonna cheat. I'm gonna peek at my, my girl's answers. Okay, they're saying alkali metals. I've heard of that one before. I've heard of all of these before, but alkali metals got themselves a little bit of a name. I'm trusting you, Justin. Justin, this is your last chance. Justin, this is my last chance. I will change your last name to time so that way you can be a superhero. Please get this right for me. Okay, we're gonna do this. I, okay. I'm having faith Lock in the kid. In. Alkali metals. Justin, do not be a basic bitch. How else are you supposed to become in. a TikTok star in 20 years? You're going Come on. I am. Do it. Come on, Justin. That's not the right answer. Justin. 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 Yeah. Justin. Justin. Yeah. Justin. I needed to have the music stop for a minute, strictly on the fact that I need time to process my emotions and to tell Justin how much I hate him. Justin, since you came out of my womb, actually, even before that, since the moment that I knew that you existed, I have loathed you. I knew, I felt inside of my heart that you would bring me nothing but sorrow. I thought if I gave you nice things like the Legos and everything in your life that you could ever possibly want that you would be happy and that you would be a child who would take care of me when I'm old, make sure that you are a success in life and in general be an upstanding societal member. But Justin, you f***ed it. You f***ed all of it. You are a little shit. I regret every moment that I have ever spent at you. I wish that Men in Black was real, strictly so that I could have that little button thing that just zaps memories out of your head because I don't think you're worth remembering. I don't want to remember you. You bring nothing but pain and sorrow to all of humanity. If you ever start dating, I'm gonna call up any boyfriend or girlfriend that you ever have and tell them that you are shit. I will manage to have every single job reject you because you have rejected me in my kindness and I don't think that you deserve nice things inside of this world anymore. I am going to put you inside of a cave and I am going to feed you nothing but SpaghettiOs 
And I pray that you find a way to redeem yourself because right now, things are not looking very good, Justin. Kiss me. Why are you kissing me when I'm in the middle of reprimanding my f***ing child? Mwah, smoochie. Justin, you do not get any more smoochies. You deserve nothing. SpaghettiOs with the hot dogs that are rounded on both ends. Think about that, Justin. I'm so mad at him. <laughs> I'm not smiling at a fifth grade. Are you f***ing shitting me, man? I am so upset about it. We're doing one more. One more f***ing speed round. A lot of boring math later. Wait! I did it? Yes! yes! Oh my god, yes! You have to decide if you want to try to answer it or not. I'm ready. I will answer it. We're going big. Yes. Give me the million. Health. Yes, I can do this. I know so much about health. Look at me. I'm jumping for joy, man. How many aorta does a human hut or a atria? What is going through your head right now? F*** is what's going through my head right now. What the f*** is an atria? We're gonna go four. I don't think that's right, but if I'm lucky and I get a million dollars, then it'll be pretty good. So, hell yeah, hell yeah. Okay. Foy. I feel good about this one. I don't I'm think you do, girl. Head. I don't feel good about this one. She's slamming and that button, though. And for the final time. Okay. One million dollars. Uh huh. Is on the line. Yes, give me. First of all, congratulations for getting to the end of the Thank line. Thank you. It's not easy. I know. It's pretty simple. Uh huh. If you've got the right answer, you're a millionaire. Uh huh. If you don't, you will lose four hundred and seventy-five thousand dollars. And walk out of here with twenty-five thousand. At the end of the day, that's oh not that bad. I can do I it. Take much more of this. <laughs> Incorrect. Is it three? Wow, I just flunked out. How many is it? What's the correct answer? Oh God damn! Just I had zero idea what three. any of that was. Wow. Like absolutely f out. all. Nothing going on inside all of my right, brain. I was within two, words. and I think that that was I fair. I'm not, not going to get super irritated. I don't know a single Not other fifth smart. grader who would know that shit, man. That's something that college students in medical school have to know. That is not something a f***ing ten-year-old is going to know. Yeah, Justin, it's all your fault, Justin. You could have sat there and given me the peace sign, but you f***ed up. We managed to still accomplish enough shit today. I got a B. But you know what? Bs end up making it so pass. That was painful. You know what? I actually had a lot of fun. Forgive me for being a little bit more unhinged than I typically am, but you know what? Sometimes you end up just uh, getting the road rage and you gotta let out your shit. And, uh, mwah. Good night! Mwah!